Hello everyone. So this is the video number four of the same chapter, landscape of the soul. Already the chapter is over, but we are having some extra informations regarding art forms. So let's have a look. Now this is an article which was published in Hindustan Times, 28 August 2005, by Brinda Suri. So let's read. Getting inside outsider art. When French painter John Rovefort mooted the concept of art brood in the 1940s, the art of the untrained visionary was of minority interest. So this painter ultimately started one special kind of art form, that is art brood or raw art. That means the art of the untrained visionary was of minority interest. And the untrained painters, their different critical approach about art. From its almost veiled beginnings, outsider art has gradually become the fastest growing area of interest in contemporary art internationally. Now, the approach is changing. Previously, it was completely uh, not having any kind of importance. Now, they are having importance as well as the fastest growing area of interest. This genre is described as, uh, as the art of those who have no right to be artists as they have received no formal training. So these are the artists, those who are having no formal trainings that how to draw, how to paint, yet show talent and artistic insight, but they are also having their different kind of talents. Their works are a stimulating contrast to a lot of mainstream offering, definitely because they are not having the same kind of approach towards the uh, drawing and painting. That is why there will be a contrast with the mainstream offerings. Around the time, Dovford was propounding his concept in India, an untutored genius was creating paradise. Years ago, uh, the little patch of jungle uh, that he began clearing to make himself a garden sculpted with stone and recycled material is known to the world today as the rock garden at Chandigarh. So this is the rock garden. So in this way, he ultimately uh, cleared the entire uh, jungle, the forest and with the stone and recycled material he ultimately made these sculptures which is known as rock garden at Chandigarh. Its 80 year old creator director Nick Chand is now hailed as India's biggest contributor to outsider art. The fifth issue spring 2005 at raw vision Sorry, the 50th issue, Spring 2005 Raw Vision, a UK-based magazine pioneer in outsider art publications, features Nick Chen and his rock garden sculpture, Woman by the Waterfall on its anniversary issues cover. So this was the reward that they got for this uh, rock garden, right? Their name ultimately published, the entire concept got a kind of platform in this UK based magazine pioneer. The notion of art, brute or raw art was of works that were in their raw state as regards cultural and artistic influences. Anything and everything from a tin to a sink to a broken down car could be material for a work of art. So this is the way that the difference ultimately made. That from a tin to a sink, anything we can use as a form of art if you are having the talent you don't have to be a traditional way of learner you don't have to have uh, that kind of formal training if you can turn anything into a beautiful thing that is your talent that is the new approach towards art something Nick Chand has taken to dizzling high dizzing high recognizing his art as an outstanding testimony of the difference a single man can make when he lives his dream, the Swiss Commission for UNESCO will be honoring him by way of European exposition of his works. The fifth, sorry, the five-month interactive show Realm of Nectar, beginning October, will be held at leading museums in Switzerland. So these, this is the date, 2005. In this time, the article was published. So maybe after some years or after some months, these programs ultimately held. The five month interactive show realm of next chance okay beginning of october uh, so we are reading a story which is already done this is article uh, beginning in october will be held at leading museums in switzerland belgium and france and italy the biggest reward is walking through the garden and seeing people enjoy my creation next chance says so this is the 
biggest reader that next channel ultimately said and this article published as i said 28 august 2005 in hindustan times right so this is the sculpture so we got to know about the different kind of art forms and the different kind of approach that you don't have to be a traditional way of learner uh, any kind of art that is having some philosophy that is having some artistic uh, beauty that can be called as a new way of learning a new way of art right so this this is what the article is saying first of all it it was not having that kind of interest it was considered an outsider art but now this is also one of the genre right so this is the chapter landscape of the soul thank you